I'm here to show you how to do a relatively simple simple fix of entropion. Um, I did a video last year on how to do entro fix an entropion by cutting out a small uh, football shape a piece of skin from under the eye. This is not a real bad metropian, so I'm gonna fix it with a penicillin shot, hopefully. Um, if this doesn't work, this is my first thing I do, and if this doesn't work, then I go ahead and, and opt to remove the actual um, piece of skin. But if you start with the penicillin, it's kinda nice because the, the penicillin uh, irritates the, the tissues underneath this area, and it'll actually stiffen it up. So the, the actual pressure of the penicillin rolls the eye, lashes off the eyeball, and then just the irritation of the penicillin in that tissue actually causes it to like get stiffer. So it holds it that way when it finally absorbs the penicillin. So this is the little baby goat that we're gonna do. This is really hard for me to video. There he is. And uh, you probably can't see because I got the light going on my, whoa. And you see, see how it's kind of wet wait, under wait, here? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, you can see it, huh? <laughs> So see here how it's kind of wet and there's like creases in the eye and his eyelid is actually, is our eyelashes are actually scratching on the, on the surface of his eyeball here. It's all right, buddy. So what, by rolling it out with some pressure, we can actually, peel, see it in there? See how it's rolled onto the eye? We can actually get it to, oh my gosh, I can't do it. Wrong angle. Sorry, baby. <laughs> We can actually there, get that there. There's the actual eyelid. So see that dent right there, right, right in here? I'm going to fill that with penicillin, and hopefully that will work to roll the tissue out and keep it off his eyelid or eyeball. And if that doesn't work, we'll cut that piece out, and uh, it'll heal up just fine that way too. But this is the first step. It's not too invasive. All right. It's all right, buddy. And go. All right, so you can see there's the eyelids rolled in there. Now, it's really important that you have a good hand, a good holder like Dakota here. Because this is super important, this baby goat does not move. He's like, you gotta be kidding me, that was horrible. But so, okay, now see, if you look, I don't know if you can see him. Oops, don't choke him up here. So terrible. I know, baby. Here, buddy. So if you look here, that's, that seemed awful. But right now, you can see his eyelid is flat against his eye. Right there. Oh, he's loud. <laughs> he is loud. Especially we're inside this little dome, so Poor it's really thing. loud. But that actually... I know, I'm so sorry. That actually is less painful for him right now. That procedure obviously wasn't probably very pleasant. But it's actually easier for him now because it's not scratching on the surface of his eyeball anymore. He has a little bit on top too, like you were saying. You're right, how it rolls over. That might just fix it. Yeah, he might, he, you know, sometimes they have to grow into their own eyeballs. Okay, so. Here, let him, get him up here in the camera so they can see. I'm so sorry, little honey. Well, believe it or not, he'll be more comfortable tonight. And maybe it'll fix it. Maybe not. Um, but he's really cute either way. He's really cute either way. Yeah, that looked good. That worked out pretty good. It's got the got it off the surface of his eye, so at least he's comfortable for tonight. Um, anyway. And then you have to see his sisters. They're so cute. Remember, we need to get him to nurse. Yep. The camera's trying to go over. Here's one sister. Oh, 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 all three of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're cute babies. Hi, babies. Yeah. We got... All right, I'm done. Ew, ew, ew. Ready? Put my knee in something gross. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in here, not a surprise. All right. Here's a little goat that was born on the 12th of January that we did the um, entropian penicillin shots under the eyelid there. We did it right underneath here. And um, above. On, on both sides, yeah, and above even on one of them. And as you can see, it worked. He has absolutely no... <laughs> Eyelash interference onto his eyeball. He's sitting really still right now. And uh, whoop, where you go? And it was a successful procedure. So that's one way to repair entropion if you can catch it early enough. And it's it's right at birth. You'll see it right at birth within a few hours of them being dry. You'll realize that underneath the eye is no is not dry because it's weeping. It's already starting to tear. Um, if you can catch it real quick like that, you can. You okay? okay. Do I gotta put him back down? That's fine. Do a shot Start. of um, 
Uh, kind of selling in there to repair it. And obviously that goat would not be a candidate for breeding. He will be one of my the market lamb or, or market lamb market goat for my kids to take to the fair this year. But um, it didn't cost anything really, and it was simple enough, and it was successful. So that's my way to fix entropian in a day old baby goat. <laughs> that feels so good. <laughs> that's ridiculous. So cute. <laughs>